Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. Just take a look at that list where we've been so far still holding at three names. We are watching that area that potential tropical cyclone number four in the western Gulf of Mexico down into the Bay of Campeche worked its way to the northwest. Never actually developed into a tropical depression and certainly never achieved that name status. So we're holding at three names used so far. Next name on list is Danielle still waiting to see when that's going to happen and we're starting to see more and more signs that the activity is going to start to get a little more uh, active as, as we go through the next uh, several days and really over the next couple of weeks. So throughout the month of August, the areas that we look at is really pretty much anywhere. We're looking further and further out into the central and eastern Atlantic, the Gulf of Mexico, the western Atlantic down into the Caribbean, really always a prime spot throughout the hurricane season. We are, do have this one area that we've been watching for a couple of days. Uh, this tropical wave moved off the coast of Africa, still pretty disorganized at this point. Hurricane Center putting about a 20% chance of future development over the next five days. And that closer view still showing quite a bit of convection. You get these flare ups and then they start to wane and then you get another flare up. So it's still a fairly disorganized system and still it's going to take some time. If it's going to develop, it's going to take many days. This is not going to be a day or two process. Uh, you look at the Saharan air layer. We still have some of that dry air, but overall compared to what we've seen over the past several weeks, you are seeing less of that dry air. The wind shear still have some stronger wind shear to the south, but still moving into an environment that it looks like that wind shear may start to cooperate over the next several days. So you watch the Fox model. Here's the area that we're speaking of. Just kind of a broad area of low pressure or a tropical wave working its way onto the west. And notice as we go through the next few days, you're still seeing a fairly broad circulation with this. You're really not seeing the winds pick up all that much, and it's just going to continue to track onto the west and the west northwest as we go through the rest of the week. Long range computer models are suggesting this will continue that slow development as it works its way uh, onto the west, getting uh, say south of Bermuda. But that's still a long ways off. We've got a lot, a lot of time to watch this. And of course, we'll keep you updated right here on myfoxhurricane.com.